Hey guys, it's Windy from Windy Star. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to paint succulent plant in watercolor. I'll talk about the techniques I use and walk you through step by step how I complete this painting. Now, if you're ready, grab your pens and paper and let's start painting. As always, I start with my sketch. I drew out the basic shape and I pressed down a little harder on my sketch so you can see more clearly. But try to keep the sketch lighter on your paper. After that, I outlined it with light watercolor and erased the pencil sketch. So there's no pencil sketch left on my finished painting. Then I start painting the petal at the button area. I'm using wet on wet techniques here. I apply clean water first, then quickly add colors while the paper is still wet, so the color blends out nicely. Then I add darker shades around the bottom areas of the petal so it looks more 3D. For the second petal, I first put a base layer on, then add colors while the paper is still wet so there's no hard strokes and the petal color looks nice and smooth. For the next one, it's the similar painting process. I first put a base layer on, then add darker shades while the paper is still wet. And notice this petal is behind the other petals, so the color is darker. Also, make sure you leave a blank area where the two petals overlap, so they look more 3D. For the next petal, I first pan out the darkest shades around the top area, then I dip my pen brush into clean water, and continue panning out the lower part of the petal. Then I add the darkest shades again at the bottom area to show the reflections in the middle part of the petal and the graded colors. Next, for the base layer, I first add the green color around the top area, then connect it with purple shades while the paper is still wet, then I add darker colors for the second layer. You can soften the hard edges using clean water, as you can see here. For the other petals, I used a similar painting process as before. I first blend out the base layer, then add darker shades afterwards. Continue painting out the other petals until finish.
For the stem, I first put a base layer on, then I dry my brush and wipe out the reflection areas in the middle. Then I add details. Lastly, the touch up, I go back and add details on the petal and the stem. Now the painting is about done here, comment below and let me know what do you think about it. That's all for today's video, I really hope it's helpful and if you enjoyed it. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to my channel and ring that bell so you never miss out on my weekly art videos and tutorials. Thank you so much for watching, I'll see you next week. Bye!